YouTube. I got another one, man. I got Get a Taste, Ruby Rose. You know, she's on Drewski channel. You know, it's a little cooking channel. I mean, a little cooking series he got. You know what I'm saying? My girl Ruby Rose on here. You know what I'm saying? Shout out, Ruby. <laughs> you know, I don't want a Jada Waiter. I want a Ruby Rose. You know what I'm saying? Boom. Let's see baby girl cook. Let's see what she could throw down, man. Straight up. We're just going to go ahead and get into it. Let's see what she, what she put together. What's up, everybody? You're watching In the Kitchen. And she better wash them hands. Today, we will be cooking <coughs> some Jetta. Straight up. This mm -hmm. episode of In the Kitchen is brought to you by Raising Cane's Chicken Fingers. Raising Cane's Bust. I'm Eritrean. This is a dish that I like toast too. and Eritrea hook. So we're going to start with just prepping the vegetables in the meat. Let's get started. Let's start about washing them hands. That's what you need to start. All through all my childhood, my mom and grandma would it might bust, for me. I loved spicy food. My senior year of high school, my mom, for Christmas, as my Christmas gift, she got me cooking lessons. I was so upset. Now I really. Now that blew me gift. too. My eyes are burning. Oh my god. I need goggles. I like serrano peppers. I don't like when people don't like stuff, so I don't ever cook for my name. Maybe that's why I'm single. Tomatoes, cutting out the core. Mm. I've eaten this dish a million times. I've been to Africa. I've seen them slaughter the cow, and then we eat the cow for dinner. I plucked a few feathers off the chicken before we ate it. This is garlic. Mm. We just need a few cloves. I that's like usually what you do, like Ruby. <laughs> how you know you don't cook at the crib. Right? That's what the you usually do. You know, you take though, the, will make you burn the hairs off the chicken stomach, and pluck them. Sometimes really they're on there in the package. Ladies, health as well. Health, health as well. We don't want to see them. We want to see Ruby getting them out of here. Need a little water. What is she, what is not and now right. we have beef ribeye steak. Mm. I'm going to give it a little rinse. Okay, you should have rinsed them hands, but ooh, nice. I like how you slap Here's that meat, board. girl. So this is called <laughs> meat. This is like <laughs> they like <laughs> spices in it. So you just put a good amount, get the pan lubricated, and the wet. Oh mm. my god, it already smells good as fuck. Ruby talking that talk. She talking that talk right now. I don't know if it's just me, <laughs> but she talking that talk. Oh man. Now I'm cutting the meat. This is real food porn like right here. Fat. Cut it into like little small pieces. Yeah, the fat be having a, the, the, on the, the, the ribeye, the fat be having that I'm flavor. The pan's getting a little hot. She gonna now season that meat up? Some onions. She gonna put some seasoning on that meat? I see the seasons over there. You gonna put some seasoning on that meat? In this other pot, we're going to be cooking shudo. Same thing, just add some shudo. test meat, let okay. it simmer. We're going to add some onions. I love onions. I'm going to add a little bit more to sweet too. I don't know what she's doing, Take but she likes she's doing her thing, though. I ain't going to care. I don't know the measurements. You just got to eyeball it. And Let me find out real good. Once you're a pro, you just kind of know. This is bare bare. Dried onions, dried garlic. It gives it a nice color. So once the onions start getting a little brown, then we add the meat and the water. Purified water, that is. Once okay, water, real bougie shit, real bougie shit. <laughs> Shawty went straight purified bottle water. No tap? Okay, straight bougie shit. Starts to boil, then we will add the sugar powder. So I'm going to add diced beef. Mm -hmm. You want to spread that out? That's cooking bigger color, diced beef. That's still rib by steak, just cut up. Just some salt. We're adding some tomatoes, freshly cut. Baby, you're supposed to season that meat before butter, you butter. put it in there. Make this milk spicy as hell. You're supposed to season that meat and take it in your hand and... A little bit. A little bit goes a long way. I guess that's seasoning it. So we're starting to get some color. Okay. If you don't cover the meat, it'll dry the meat out. And we want it juicy and, you know, fresh, so... Mm -hmm. Gotta keep it covered. I'm gonna add you know some rosemary. Song. I love rosemary, like... On everything. Getting hot in the kitchen, y'all. It's coming together. Okay. So now, when you add the shudo powder, it's extremely imperative that you start stirring it quickly, pushing it into the pan so that there's no lumps, because you don't want lumpy nothing ever. 
It looks a little bit watery, but it will thicken up. Mm. Not gonna lie, I forgot to add the garlic. Better late than never. Now we're adding the tomatoes and the shiro. Let it steal up, wetting up in there. Also, a little salt. Wait a minute. <laughs> I thought she knew off the top of her head. Now she got the recipes right there on the phone. One cup. And then somebody texts her the recipes at that. Oh, she definitely texts her mom. Mom, what's that uh, recipe that we used to make as a kid? <laughs> no, for real. That's definitely what she probably did. Mom, what's that recipe real quick? Ain't nothing wrong with it because you cooking it at the end of the day. I ain't. I ain't talking on you, Ruby. You know what I'm saying? I ain't talking down on you because you actually doing it. I'm watching you cook it. So it ain't about the recipe because you need the recipe because maybe you just forgot. I'm being biased, ain't it? Let, let that have been somebody up, up here. Man, that nigga don't know what the fuck you doing. <laughs> Love you, Ruby. Okay, just sprinkle that in there. Mm -hmm. So we're gonna leave the meat on a simmer, get the flavors. Mind going. you, she doing this all on the on the on the hot on the. I forgot spray. what the thing is called. Crunchy, we go like this to taste it. That tastes disgusting. No, I'm <laughs> oh, she the washed her hands after that again too. Put into the sesame. Let that cook. The whole half cut ones. You put it in the shiro. The sure seeds of the pepper is what makes it spicy. See, I never had Ethiopian like food, spicy. but you know what I'm saying? I don't really, ooh. Just adding that. I tell her, nah, I don't really like the spicy stir. food. It don't sit well in my stomach. Jetta. It has barley and yeast. My grandma be making it. Very delicious. So this is the tibs. Cooked to perfection. And you just that look pretty good. Like, like a this. nice fajita. Not on my chef, Man, child. that just made me want some chipotle. This is this. I was gonna cap. Get into oh, oh, little, little. I don't think that. <laughs> <laughs> I don't think that was supposed to be coming out like uh, like chicken soup. <laughs> like what? <laughs> that thing sounded watery. It didn't lumpy it. That tomatoes in there, but. <laughs> oh, it's supposed to be wet like that. I guess I don't know. I ain't never had better. Ethiopian food before. It was good though. It's Maybe not bad. she it's gotta not cook bad. it one more time okay. for me. You know what I'm saying, Ruby? If you see this, I need a plate. You know what I'm saying? Cook it for me one time for the one time. You know what I'm saying? Thank you, sister. Okay, Thank you take you. it. Okay, so you Let's take see. it. Boom. Okay, I get it now. You take it. You pull a piece off. It's like fufu. I ain't never had like you know African food like that. I ain't never had fufu or anything, but I know I know of it. So you take it. Take the bread, put some meat, and dip it in in, in the in the little. I don't want to call it gravy, but in the in the you know the the liquid, whatever that is. She made the uh, thing. I forgot what she just said it was, but boom. You know what I'm saying? I ain't never had Ethiopian food. You know what I'm saying, Ruby? If you see this, man? I don't know. Call out your boy, man. I need to, I need to, I need to try it. Put me on. <laughs> Thank you guys for watching In the Kitchen with me, Ruby Rose. And this is how you cook in Jetta with Tibbs and Chitta. <laughs> man, that looked pretty decent, man. I can't even lie. She did better than I think she would, man. But hey, man, shout out Ruby Rose, man. Like, comment, subscribe, man. I got many, 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 many more coming, man. You know what I'm saying? So... I'm out.